the saying goes, lightning never strikes the same place twice, but sometimes, all it takes is one. Lightning's beauty can be enjoyed from the safety of shelter in most cases, but for livestock on open ranges, it isn't always so easy to find sufficient cover. They congregate under structures such as a tree, or they congregate around water, or maybe even a fence, uh, something like that, because it's an area where they can somewhat find shelter. IX Ranch Vice President Richard Roth is familiar with the trouble lightning can sometimes cause on the ranch. So when we've had lightning strikes in the past on our place, uh, we do, our cattle during the summer are not typically around the buildings. It's more of a case where it's maybe one animal uh, every couple years. Sometimes cattle are struck directly. Uh, cattle are just typically maybe the tallest thing out there at the time, and they're more susceptible to a lightning strike. And sometimes lightning strikes taller objects in an open field, like trees, or an area of the ground where a puddle has formed, and just one bolt can take out large amounts of livestock at once. Just this past June, 15 sheep from a Mile City ranch were killed all at once by just one bolt. The owner of Claybow Livestock says they were all huddled around a metal fence when the summer storm rolled through. A single bolt of lightning can cost ranchers upwards of tens of thousands of dollars. And while insurance is available for most types of livestock, Ross says it isn't just a financial loss when livestock dies. Because I don't think people oftentimes understand. I mean, even in a big place, you're like, oh, they lost one cow or, or they lost even 30 if they're a bit, you know, I'd have to say that, that ranchers in general and, and farmers, anybody who owns livestock, it's an emotional loss. I mean, they become kind of your children.